of Vienna at that time, I'm sure people have told you many times that tree, trees up and down Maple Avenue, beautiful overhanging trees, single lane going through Vienna. Uh, the one thing, I bet you no one has said, they had open ditches right outside of town. And the reason I can remember those open ditches, we were coming home from work one day in a snow snowstorm. And uh, a, a couple of soldiers had slid over in a ditch. We got out, stopped the car, didn't talk traffic anything. All of us got out and hoisted the car out of the ditch, you know. But that was kind of common occurrence in case mm. ditches were open. So but, uh, the trees were so, it was such a beautiful area. Years ago, also, the Safeway, I think when we first moved in, the Safeway was across the street from Magruder. So I, I'm going to keep calling Magruder because there were no Magruder. Mm -hmm. um, and then it moved down, of course, uh, where Walgreens is now, and uh, and later, of course, they built a giant, a giant. I remember a giant a field out there had a, a prettiest holly tree you'd ever want to see. You remember the holly tree, Mike? It was a huge tree with berries all over it, and they of course had to cut it down to make the parking lot. Oh. It was a great big house outside of Vienna, great old house. The whole fa bunch of families lived in the house. That was an old Civil War house, I'm sure. We moved to uh, Church Street in 1963. And this uh, house? This, big this house? This house, uh-huh. All the house, the, the uh, house across the street, the houses across the street were not there. Uh, the house that was on the corner, Miss Taylor had a house. She was a big, the big white house. They physically moved that house down to Cook's, where Cook's is. I wish I had some pictures of that house going down. They had to put on rollers and, and, and got it down to, uh, and attached to Cook's house. How in the world he got it by building inspections, I don't know. As everybody asked me that. I said, you know, I, I only live here, you know. I heard it was a big event. <laughs> yeah, it was, yeah. Uh, the trees on, on Church Street now, we go to uh, main of Church Street. Uh, the trees are overhanging church trees, beautiful trees. One day I got a knock at the door as Maud Robinson. I didn't know Maud. And she said, uh, Mr. Lancaster, I said, do you realize they're having a meeting tonight at the, the town hall? The, uh, the power company is suggesting or proposing that they cut the trees down on Church Street to make room for the power lines. I said, what? I, she said, yeah, I said they they didn't post it or something. I, I can't remember the story. Maud still remembers this. I always remember that the first meeting of Maud. Um, anyway, uh, we went to the, to the meeting. And I couldn't believe some of the, uh, some of the comments of people who lived on the street said, hey, you know, hey, that saved us from cutting, picking up leaves. I have leaves. And so all of us spoke up and said, man, these beautiful trees cut down and what? And uh, so they turned it down. I think it was enough protest. And uh, that, uh, so my, that was my meeting, my first meeting with Maud. <laughs>